Oh. Hi guys, it's me, Oxfu, on Let's Play. Sorry, hello and welcome to Let's Play Super Mario 64 with me, Oxfu. I should not be starting out with, like, hi guys, it's me, Oxfu. Beat the ghost to his own home. Um. But like, I'm, I'm thinking to myself, like, this is the fifth episode that I've recorded in a row, I think. And the only reason that I'm doing five episodes is because I don't want to stop playing the game at all. Oh my god, like, whoa. Can we already do King Boo up there? Really? That's kind of weird. Um... I know it said King Boo's merry-go-round, but... I don't want to do that yet. Come on, come on. Here we go. No, don't jump off the... Because now that we have the invisible... Oh yeah, this is going to take me forever too, because what you have to do in this room is... You see how there's like the slimmest bit of wall right there? But there's also all this... Well, you have to shimmy across. What you have to do is... That. Now you're thinking to yourself, okay, that's pretty easy. Because now we're on the third floor. And... Okay, that makes sense. <laughs> we're on the third floor anyway. Um, there's actually a star that you have to get through here, and it's the most annoying star in this level. So I'm going to take care of it right now. Because what you have to do is... Oh, careful, there's a trick floor right there. Forgot about that. Is you see this invisible block right here? You have to be able to do that trick and get up to that floor and go through that wall all before this cap wears off. And I swear to God, if this takes me more than like. No! See, that's the problem. Like, if you don't do it perfectly, you're never gonna get it. And you have to do it on like your first or second try is one of the most annoying times. And you can actually kill yourself doing this, because as you saw, I took two damage. There's only the one red coin here, so... I probably should not have spent the time getting that. Shoot. See, that's the other problem. Like, I hate this star so much. I'm sorry, but I really do. Like, uh, I'm not trying to be bitter or anything. It's just this... This star is overly complicated. Like, it's an interesting... It's an interesting idea for a star, but as far as being able to pull it off reliably... Yeah, see, if you don't do it right, you go off the, the middle, and you're never going to get up there. Like, you have to do it perfectly as soon as you get over there. Otherwise, there's, no, uh, there's pretty much no point in trying to get it at all. Fortunately, the... The invisible cap does just respawn, so it's not like. Yeah, see. Honestly, this is the only way I really know of how to get it. Like, if there is another way, let me know because this is this is absolutely ridiculous. Like, uh, one second, I gotta go get. Well, one second. Might as well stay here. So I'm just going to this room because I knew this. Come on, come on. Look at me. Come on, I want your five blue. I want your blue coin. There we go. Um. Okay, the books don't respawn because I could get coins from them as well, but. Ugh. This is going to be the episode where I just wipe a lot. Sorry about this, guys. But it has to get done, and I'd rather do it early on like this than... Ah, oh, come on. I'd rather do it early on like this than be in the middle of more fun episodes and have to deal with this crap. This is also the last star in Boo's Mansion, so... I do have to say, though, 
Um, one of the things about having so many constant pausings is that I'm able to appreciate a lot of what they did with, well, the pauses themselves. Like, I never noticed before that- Oh! No! Oh, that was so close! Oh, come on! right there and we'd have done with been done with this but no I've, I've actually been able to um notice that unlike most nintendo games or most games in general that this game actually pauses the music when you pause the game as well i mean i can just pause it right here and you guys wouldn't even notice i'll give you a hint about that actually i didn't actually pause it that was really badly done. I'm sorry. <laughs> I was panicking because of the invisibility cap. I was actually planning this um, while the heater was on last time. I was going to be like, oh, I can pause it and like s slap the directional pad or something so that you thought I pressed the start button. Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on. Get in there, get in there. No, 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 no. Oh. But anyway, I was gonna do something like this. Like I bet you couldn't even, you wouldn't even be able to tell if I paused it right now. Like that. I should have done it like that. See? Then you wouldn't have been, a then you wouldn't have been able to tell how sloppy it was. I'm sorry about that. That really was sloppy, even for me. <laughs> <laughs> And then I was gonna be like, guess what, guys? I didn't actually pause the game. <laughs> present day, present time. <laughs> oh, come on! It's the second time we were able to do it. And then just, no. You know what? You took too long, because you had to, you were able to do it on your second try. <sighs> It was just like a centimeter lower, it would be infinitely easier to. There we go, finally, and that only took us like six, seven minutes or something like that. What do we have back here? What do we have to show for it? Nothing except a giant eyeball and another invisibility cap. Look, he can even see us, even though we're invisible. And you just spin around them, and he spins around, and then star. All we have to show for it. You know what, guys? Well, know what else we have to show for it? If you'll see, we have 29 stars now. Which means we are now a quarter of the way through the game. Okay, I'm sorry about that, guys. Of course it's my luck that as soon as we have that something actually happen that's important, I have a technical problem and my dazzle starts dropping frames. So again, just sorry about that. But anyway, we're hearing from God again. <laughs> or, you know, that toad in the ceiling with the megaphone. You've recovered 30 power stars. Now you can open the door with the big star. But before you move on, how's it going otherwise? <laughs> did you pound the two columns down? You didn't lose your hat, did you? If you did, you'll have to stomp on the condor to get it back. They say that Bowser has sneaked out of the sea and into the underground. Have you finally cornered him? Not quite. <laughs> um, yeah. No, no, we're, we're actually... That's actually kind of... I, I'm gonna go there later. It's just, I wanna, I wanna see if I can do something before we do that. So, anyway guys, that's 30 stars, and I think we've spent like a good 10 minutes on that, so I think it's time to actually tell you guys goodbye for this episode. You know, it's, it's again, quarter of the way getting through the game. It's, I think, a good, a good place to stop for now. So, I'm going to see you guys next time. I'll just leave you with this. No, 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 come on, I... I... Oh, come on, now I can't do it. Yeah, whatever. It wasn't important anyway. Alright, so next time we 
don't know what we're gonna do. We could actually. Oh no, you know what? Haha, <laughs> he's not talking about that one. He's talking about. He's not talking. <laughs> For a second, I thought that that was a big star door. Ha <laughs> ha I'm so silly. No, he's talking about this door. We can open this door. So next time, we will see what's behind door number two. On Let's Play Super Mario 64 with me, Oxfoo. Take it easy, guys.